All right, Catherine Holmes uh, has a website, and I'm going to promote it in this video. I love you, Catherine. She's a great sister in Christ, and the body of Christ. All right, so. Heralding Paul's evangel and gospel. Did you know that all mankind was saved at the cross 2,000 years ago? Just not everyone has come into the realization of it yet. For that, for for this are we toiling and being reproached that we rely on the living God who is the Savior of all mankind, especially of believers. Verse Timothy 2 through 4, For this is idea unwelcome in the sight of our, our God, Savior, God, who wills that all mankind be saved and come into the realization of the truth. It is God's will. And she does a lot of interviews with believers on her channel, and she does a lot of live streams. So... Go check her out if you don't, if you don't, if you haven't already, okay? Martin's YouTube channel she has on there. Those of whom God has called now are in the body of Christ and are believers. The rest will come into the realization of what Christ accomplished. We're all at the great white throne judgment. Romans eleven thirty two. For God locks up all together in stubbornness, and he should be merciful to all. Colossians 1.20, and through him to God consult all to him, making peace through the blood of his cause through him, whether those on earth or those in the heavens. This is good news. Firstly, I did not associate myself with any kind of religion of any sort. I left the organized religion, and God took me out of the bondage of that nearly three years ago. I only have truth from a very loving and powerful God. He is a successful Savior, not a half-Savior, and, and saving underscore all of his creation. Truth is, there is no trinity, no hell, no free will, no immortality of the soul. There are only two gospels, one for the circumcision for the Jews and one for the uncircumcision, the gospel of grace. From Paul, who is our apostle for today, to all the nations, the Holy Spirit is not a person. It is, a, it is God's divine power. The evangel and gospel is this. God sent his son, the Lord Jesus Christ, to die on the cross for all and took sin away successfully. First Timothy 4.10 says that God is the Savior of all mankind, especially of believers, Especially not exclusively, the Lord Jesus was entombed and didn't exist for three days, and not just his body, but the whole of him didn't exist for three days. Ecclesiastes 9, 5 states that the dead know nothing whatsoever. After three days of not existing, his Father God roused him from death to life. The resurrection Christ Jesus accomplished his work on the cross. God is at peace with you, whether you believe it or not. When the time comes, God will reconcile all his creation to himself because he loves all of his creation. If you don't come into the realization of the truth of who God is now on earth before Christ returns, you will after at the great white throne judgment where God will have mercy in all of his creation. Everyone will be judged in accord with their acts. And all things will be righted. Every, everyone then that have that ever lived and will ever live will be a part of God's family and will know his glory and love. God will be all in all. There's her channel. We said various uh, Body of Christ websites, various Body of Christ blogs. She has a guest book you can sign. I'm still the only one that signed it. All right. Grace, peace, and love to all of you who are watching. And God bless each and every one of you and know I love you.